news But sunlight iris full of wings Let them fly towards the sky Looks like it's been a great weekend. It sure has. It's been probably my favorite in 10 years. Wow, so 10 years is a long time. Why don't you uh, tell people a little bit about uh, how did they get started? How did the first one come about? Well, the first one was actually a descendant of a gathering we had in the 90s called the Good People's Gathering, which uh, we had tried to build into a festival, the biggest one being in 97, um, where we had about 600 people here. And uh, it, it, it went fairly well. We finally broke even. Uh, but then the staff fell apart and we didn't start again until 2005. And 2005 was just basically started because we wanted to bring a bunch of our musician friends here to have a party at the end of summer, the harvest party. And um, we were playing in Mama Groove a lot then and uh, meeting lots of amazing musicians. And so we ha and then we realized, well, we, we have to help them with expenses and blah, blah, blah. And then we decided to start charging the public. And it was actually very small. That first year we had about 300 people in 2005. <laughs> usually have between uh, 30 and 40 acts, 35 acts is, is what I'm estimating right now. And one of the things people like about this festival is that it's kind of a really intimate setting. It's beautiful, you're right in the mountains, right by the river, uh, but it's also kind of a, uh, a really nice vibe, very friendly, very warm, very, very mountain. Well, I'm glad to hear that. That's what we're striving for, absolutely. This is the most peaceful event we've had, actually, in 10 years. And it's a pretty eclectic uh, music. How, how do you go about programming the festival? Well, you'd have to talk to my wife about that. She works year-round full-time on, on this project as artistic director, also as our pr promotional organizer, treasurer for the board, pretty much everything up to the actual hosting of the festival she does. She designs the, the program exclusively to build a, a certain vibe, basically. So it's not just about, uh, it, it's about what will fit together. Right. And it is pretty eclectic. I've seen everything. Well, I, I couldn't even begin to describe just on the Sunday here how many different acts I've seen. It's, it's really kind of unique. Yes, it is. We have a reputation for that, which we're really proud of, actually. It's, it's probably the, the best thing for me about the festival is the eclectic nature and yet cohesive nature of how the acts blend together. Somebody else's house Now what does it all mean? Peter would ask me again and again and again First I used to chuckle like I was Too solid for such a flaky question But now I wish to know why I wish to know the name of the thing that I know not be That's another thing, you, you seem to have lots of different kinds of workshops on here. I saw an accordion workshop earlier, an astrology workshop, all kinds of things going on. Pretty much anything goes. We even have an Earthship workshop going on uh, yesterday, you know, just on, on techniques and, and the whole science behind um, Earthship Biotexture. We have some from the uh, graduates from the Earthship Biotexture Academy in, in Taos, New Mexico. 
that are up here working with us. Well, I tried to tell you so, but I guess you didn't know that you were from the start. Baby, when you broke my heart, that I had to come again and show you that it went, and show you that it went. Oh, baby, you lied to me. If all times I said that I loved you, you lied to me. Yes, you cried. Yes, I tried. You lied to me. For those times I said I'd die for you, you lied to me. Yes, I cried. Yes, I cried. You lied to me. Oh, baby. You lied to me. Shot ain't don't like no light, you know. You lied to me. Yeah. Oops, okay. Maybe we can get some of you guys singing that really loud with us. I can leave it on here. So you lied to me. You lied to me. One more. You lied to me. That's the kind of volume I'm talking about. Let's do that again. You lied to me. Beautiful. And another one after that. You lied to me. Year 11 it promises to be a very eclectic mix of international music. It's we're really focusing on. Um, supremely individual international artists that, that we're bringing in for next year. Well, congratulations on a wonderful festival. Thank you and Shara and, and your team for uh, putting on this great event and for doing it for the last 10 years. And here's hoping for another 10 great years. Well, thanks a lot for interviewing us.